Hello everyone, welcome back to the repair. Today we're going to replace a laptop screen for Toshiba. Let's find out the model first. This one is called Satellite C60, as you can see. So first thing is first, what are you going to do? We're going to take out the battery. This is the first job. Okay. And now we're going to take out four screws as you can see there is a i don't think so it comes on the focus or not you know uh anyway this one shuttered inside and bruises so we must need to replace it first we need to take out the four screws normally these four screws sealed with kind of a plastic cap on it you know this sort of thing so to peel it off first with any sharp tools like kind of tweezer or something else okay so now we're going to remove the screws The four screws are same inside, so we don't care about arranging. Now, what you need to do, we need to put your fingernails or the grip in here and try to pull it out, okay? As you can hear the sound, noise. All right. Super hot today. Fine, now use a tweezer. Try to take out the plastic bezel, front one. Hey, how are you? Okay? Fine, and you. All right, so the bezel already came out. Let's take out this as well. Fine. Okay, so now <clears throat> this screen comes with two or three side screws. I always like to put a support at the back with anything because we're going to lose these hinges, as you can see here and there. I'm going to make it a little bit loose. I'm going to keep the support at the back. Fine. Now, from the side way, we're going to take it out. One. Two. Sit down. Three screws already removed, and there is another three right from here. Good. So the six of them already been removed. Now, make sure you keep your finger grip here. Keep it because this camera flex comes with sticky adhesive at the back. 
okay so when you pull out the string there is a chance to tear off okay the flex so push it here keep a grip on it and pull it out that's fine now okay that's fine what are you gonna do we're gonna take out the flex which is right here all right so the actual skin already removed which is broken and this is the model number as you can see here So here is the another replacement. I pulled it out from a non-working laptop. What are you gonna do? We're gonna connect the flex in right here and put the screw back, then everything will be done. Okay, let's check if some of the screw drop under there. Yeah. One. Okay, fine. Let's check in that side. Now, everything all good. So now, we're gonna connect it here. It's better if you can take it out. And you don't have to. So let's connect this flex. Everything is fine. Okay, so we're going to try one side by one side. Let's, let's put it from here. Hello, guys. Hi. Hi. Yeah. I've got the keys in that one. Thousand dollars. Nearly done. So now let's put it back first. The side screws. Which is right here. And keep the support at the back. You never know. Okay. And I always like to start from the top. This is much easier. One is done, now the second middle one, which is right here. Good. Then the third bottom one. One side is done, and now the other side, right here, to the support in case. Good. So I'm going to start from here. Second one. That is the third one, the side away. So once it's done, then what do you have to do? You have to 
focus in these two hinges screws this and that don't forget to tidy otherwise the hinge is going to be break easily plastic frame the bezel you can push it a little bit downwards much easier and then try with this good now start from the top Four screws back in place. So now another two screws right here. Check if there's any gap. If any gap, then you can push it together. It does make little click noise if there is any gap. Yeah. There are now four caps on the screw. What are you going to do? We're going to put some glue in here just to close it back it will drop and use your tweezers and put it on the face It seems everything is fine physically, so we're going to turn it on and double check if the screen is okay or not. Press the power button, and if you see the light, we could say this is absolutely brilliant. All right, as you can see, the screen is coming on. We could say the screen replacement is done for Toshiba Satellite C60, I believe. That's how you replace your screen. One more time to show you the model number. Make sure you order the right part, which is LP15.6, which is 156WH2. That's the one. I hope you do like this video. If you do, please thumbs up and don't forget to leave a comment if you have any question. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye for now.